Hello, hello, beautiful people, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ortal Levitan, AKA The Work at Unicorn on all social media platforms. So today I wanna to talk to you guys about commenting, the good, the bad, and the ugly. And yes, there are good and bad sides to all of it. So I'm gonna cover it today, and trust me, you guys wanna stay tuned for this video because at the very end, I'll kind of explain why you shouldn't over comment. But before we dive in, if you could do me a huge favor and give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe. It really helps me out with the YouTube algorithm and you guys never miss any of my content. Okay, so let's dive in. Commenting. As you guys know, especially with Instagram's new algorithm, commenting is very, very important. Comments actually rank higher than likes do or than impressions and reach. And if you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, make sure to go check out my YouTube video, The Instagram Algorithm Explained. I break it down for you all there. But basically comments count and they're really important in establishing the relationship according to the algorithm. And so that's why when people comment on your page, it really makes sure that they see more of your content and they're more likely to engage with your page and your page ranks higher. Now, that is the good side of commenting. And of course, when you comment on other people's content, you're also telling the algorithm you really care about their content, you like their page, you're more likely to see their content more often. So that is the good side of commenting. Now, there's also a bad side to commenting. There's something called over commenting, and I'm sure you've come across this. If you comment too fast, um, let's say you, I don't know, go through hashtags and you're commenting and you comment too fast, Instagram's algorithm is gonna block you. The same thing happens if you're responding to comments on your own page, you're just responding to the comments, you're also gonna get blocked if you go too fast or you comment too many comments in a specific time frame. Now, the reason Instagram did this is because they wanna prevent bots or you know automated services from engaging on the app. So this is one way that they do that. Bots will literally like or comment very, very fast. Um, they'll drop like 10 comments in the in like a span of a second or something. And Instagram is trying to combat all these third-party services and these bots and these automated services. And so they're limiting how fast you as a human being can comment back. So that's one side. They don't want you to comment back too fast or they don't want you to drop too many comments because they're flagging your account as like suspicious activity. They wanna make sure you're not a bot. The second thing that could happen is, like I said, your account is gonna get flagged. So if you comment too fast once or twice, you'll get that notification and you won't be able to comment back for like 15 minutes or you won't be able to leave any comments for 15 minutes and then it'll go away. But if you keep getting these like flag or these warnings, on your page, Instagram is gonna start flagging your account for suspicious activity and we don't want that to happen. Because essentially what it could do is accidentally, this is again all an algorithm, there's no real person looking at this. The algorithm could flag your account and assume that you are a bot or a fake account, they could deactivate you, they could block you, they could just flag your account for you know more scrutiny and we never want that. We wanna go way, way, fly way under the radar when it comes to the algorithm. So if you over comment too much or if you comment back too fast, you're gonna get flagged multiple times and we want to avoid that. And so the best way to do this is to either make sure that you comment um, a certain amount of comments and if you get blocked, don't just wait 15 minutes, wait like an hour, wait two hours. Make sure you're giving enough of a time frame so that the algorithm's not gonna be like, wait, you literally just got this like flag removed and now you're doing it again. This is really suspicious. That's one thing. Now, taking this a step further, and this has actually happened to me. So if you guys go to my post, you'll notice that I comment back on all of my comments. Unless it's like a pervy comment or someone's commenting on my butt or something, I always respond to comments. Sometimes I comment back too fast. So I used to get like those like notifications like, hey, you're temporarily blocked, whatever. I didn't really notice it. Kept commenting back. I got those like five or six times a day. Another thing is when uh, part of the methods that I teach in the Instagram Guru is active engagement. And so back in the day before I knew about this, I would just keep commenting and commenting until I got blocked. And then it would just, you know, block me from commenting. I found out the hard way that if they block you from commenting and you keep commenting once the flag is removed, you're gonna get blocked from being able to even post. So what happened is I was commenting, I was, I was like for four hours on the app that day, I was just going ham, I had a lot of time, I was excited. So I commented, commented, got blocked, commented, got blocked. And then I, I think it was like an hour after the last time that I got flagged or something. And I went and I tried to upload a picture. The picture would upload, but I couldn't upload a caption. No caption. Now at this point I can't comment either. I can't respond to comments. I can't comment on anybody else's page. I couldn't even upload a caption. So the picture would upload. In the, in the box I could type out my caption. Once I hit share, nothing. No caption, nothing. 
And so at that point, and this happened to me twice, so I knew it wasn't just a glitch. And so at that point I realized, okay, over commenting can be really, really, really bad. So here I am sharing my expertise with you. Don't over comment. Don't overdo it. And I kind of explained in this video how to avoid overdoing it. If you see that you're getting blocked more than twice, just chill. Give it an hour to chill, go do something else. So I hope this video helped and I hope you guys are not gonna go on a commenting spree and then get blocked and never be able to post again. Well, not be able to post for the next 24 hours. <laughs> So I hope that video uh, made sense. If you guys have any questions or you want me to address anything else, make sure to drop a comment below or shoot me a message at workout underscore unicorn. I always answer all of my DMs. And thank you guys again so much for tuning in. Before you leave, if you haven't done so already, make sure to give the video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out. I will see you guys next week and thanks again for tuning in.